Hello, um, welcome to my installation tutorial for Pixelate. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to run Pixelate on your local Windows PC. And we're going to be using my fork instead because I've slightly adjusted the code to make it more easier to use. So yeah, I'll only link this one in the description, but all credits go back to the original Pixelate. So to start off, um, you'll need to have Anaconda 3 installed. So if you don't have Anaconda 3, head over here and then you can download it here. Here. and uh, after you install anaconda 3 you have to go to your anaconda prompt and create an environment called Pi uh, pixel a here since i already have one um, i'm going to remove my existing one all right you'll see this proceed you can press enter and then you can activate your environment all right after that when you're done creating the environment and activating it um you have to choose a file location where you want to download all the codes at so i'm gonna go to my tutorial folder and i want to download my codes there so here i'll create a folder here and i'm gonna name it pixelate and then you go into that folder and copy the photo folders directory type in cd and then you paste the directory and if you're on a different disk to change your disk so now you're at this correct directory oh sh now you can either download codes like this manually or you can use um get clone um this one i'm going to show you this way since it's more straightforward and i'm going to rename this file to pixelate and then now if you go in it'll have all the codes inside now you just need to cd and then you can press tab and then press enter and now you're in the file directory where all the codes are on your anaconda so the next thing is you want to pip and soil requirements.txt and then next you want to pip and solve ffmpeg python this is if you want to generate videos all right so after that is done you reuse this environment you just need to condo activate pixelate the next time you open anaconda and get to the right file directory all right so to use it on an image so you need to put um le let's do this image uh so you just copy this command and then you choose you can paste it here or do it on a text text file let's see we down simple by six and we choose palette of 20 and then the image path would be input slash winter dot jpg is it yeah so it'll point towards this image and then all you have to do is just press enter after you finish finish completing the command and you just gotta wait the most time costly part about this code is the PYX function. The, this part would take long and, and for a video, since you're using the very first color palette, um, it will be very fast and you'll see, and this will be the result. All right. So you can downscale it even more 16. All right. And then you'll see downscale 16 palette 20. It's even smaller now. So if you want to see the pixel perfect version, uh, stick to the end of the video. Um, I'll show you how to evaluate it. Now we're just going to go through how to run it on videos. So for the same thing, you go to input and then you drag your video here. And so for the video, you just have to copy this command and then you paste it here and then you edit it. Downscale by six, palette 20, and then input let's see uh input slash elon dot mp4 so it's gonna refer to this video so yeah you press enter after you finish it'll break it down into frames you can see temp it'll break it all down into frames and then you can see temp output uh the results will show up here and then it'll take all these images and make it into a video so there are 30 frames i think <laughs> i look so cursed but yeah 
And if you go to output, you can see the result gonna pop up here. All right. So now if you view it on any normal um, video player, it will be this blurry quality. This is because, um, oh, it's not pixel perfect. So if you want to view these in the, the integer scaling thing I mentioned in the video, um, you have to download this video player called MPCHC. So you just download the exe and then install everything by default and then go here, start the, start the program and you go to view options, playback, um, output and resizer here, resizer and you change it to nearest neighbor. And then these settings are only available if you have video mixing render nine render less or this one enhance video render custom presenter or sync render and yeah so make sure you have those on and then after you're done press ok and if you want to view the result you just drag let's let's do the image first drag it here and then you just enlarge it and you can see it's pixel perfect and yeah for the video it should be something like this now it's per pixel perfect all right yeah that's it for this installation tutorial if you have any questions feel free to join my discord and ask there and yeah if you like what i'm doing please check out my main video or support me on my patreon and yeah i'll see you guys in the next one